everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Sprinkles and Scribbles, where I share with you all things life with a side of sweet. So I'm definitely not a morning person and most days I'm skipping breakfast, but I love all breakfast foods any time of day, especially all the sweet stuff, pancakes, French toast, and waffles. So today we're gonna to be making my favorite mocha waffles. These mocha waffles are perfect for any chocolate lover or coffee addict like me. They have both coffee and chocolate right in the waffle batter, and then you can top them with your favorite fresh fruits, whipped cream, maple syrup, and even more chocolate if you like. They're definitely an indulgent breakfast or really dessert any time of day. So let's get started. So to start, you're gonna need some melted butter. I just melted mine in the microwave. And then to that, we're gonna add some instant coffee. And then just mix the instant coffee with the butter and then just let it sit for a little bit until you're ready to use it again. Next, you're gonna take three eggs and separate their yolks from their egg whites. Then we're gonna beat the egg whites until the egg whites reach medium peaks. This just helps the waffles get a fluffy texture. Next, in a separate bowl, you're gonna add all the dry ingredients, the flour, baking soda, baking powder, sugar, as well as the cocoa powder. I'll have all the measurements linked in the blog post below. Next, it's time to add all the wet ingredients together. So we're gonna add the butter and the instant coffee to two cups of milk. And then to that, we're also gonna add the egg yolks that we had separated from the egg whites at the beginning. And then once it's all in there, you're just gonna give it a good mix until it's just one uniform batter. And then finally, it's time to combine the batter. So we're gonna add the wet ingredients, the dry ingredients, and give it a good mix until everything is mixed together and there are no streaks of flour or cocoa powder. Then we're gonna finally add in the egg whites. So for the egg whites, you just wanna fold it in with a spatula and just keep on going until there aren't any egg white clumps left in the batter. And finally, once you're ready to make your waffles, make sure to preheat your waffle maker and just oil it a little bit so that the waffles don't stick. Then pour about a third of a cup of the batter. That's how much I need it for my waffle maker. You might have to adjust depending on the size of your waffle maker. And then just close them up and let the waffles cook. Uh, you'll know your waffles are done cooking once they stop steaming from the sides of the waffle maker. And then once they're ready, you can remove them from the waffle maker with a pair of tongs and set them on a plate. And then repeat the process until you finish the rest of the batter. Finally, it's time to enjoy these mocha waffles. You can just set them on a plate and add your favorite toppings to these. I added some fresh strawberries, whipped cream, a little extra chocolate, as well as some maple syrup. And there you have it, mocha waffles, the perfect breakfast treat for all of chocolate lovers and coffee addicts out there, just like me. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and comment below and subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. See you next week.